you guys welcome back to my channel it's your boy john here how are you all doing today i hope you have all had an amazing day today um yeah i've um i'm very sorry that i didn't um upload any videos yesterday i did say that i would upload every first day but i know i didn't i had a lot of stuff on my plate which i needed to sort out but i am back now and i'm pretty much just like ready to give you guys some fresh nice amazing content so let's get started um i have been suggested to um like to make a video and state my opinion about the policeman that killed um that killed um the fellow black men and that are being racist to, racist to the black like to the black community um but yeah i'm just here to state my opinion and yeah let's get started right so first of all from what I've actually seen from this clip, what literally get me the most is the fact that the black, like that the man who was obviously suffocating and who the policeman had his knees on the neck, right? The man was literally crying for help, and the policeman did not even do, like, didn't even think about pretty much getting the neck, getting his knee off the man's neck, so the man, the least the man could have actually catch his breath back. But no, the man, the man still had his knees on the on the man's neck and then suffocated him to death. But for me, what I don't get is the man literally just was crying out for help and saying that pretty much is like I can't breathe. And the and the policeman still had his knees on the man's neck. That's literally what I don't understand. Why didn't specifically didn't they actually listen? And why didn't they put how could it, how didn't they even hear exactly what the man was saying? And even though yeah, those two policemen at the front. They could have obviously at least, they could have at least obviously listened to what the man was saying and then pretty much as I like could have done something about it. And whatever excuse they may have, people in the public was also saying, that was clearly also saying that the man couldn't breathe. They were clearly also saying that, that the man couldn't breathe, but the, but the policeman still didn't listen. They still didn't listen, like... Where's the sense? Where literally is the sense? That's what I don't get. The man was clearly stating here yeah, that basically he couldn't breathe. The community, the like the general public, were literally saying the man couldn't breathe. And then literally they were, they were still carrying on. And I just think to myself like, oh my god. How can you be so, how can you literally be so inconsiderate? Like... How can you literally be so stupid? Like, it's just absolutely stupid. It's just ridiculous. So, and then pretty much, I'm just literally just like sitting here, it's like, and based on from what I've actually seen, the man, like the, the policeman had his, the policeman had his knees on the, on the man's neck for eight minutes. For eight, for full eight minutes. Within those eight minutes, two minutes, Two minutes and fifty six seconds, the man went unresponsive. So within those two minutes, that's when pretty much the man went all, literally was that just was literally when the man was all just gone. So, I'm thinking to myself, what the hell? <laughs> literally, what the hell? And I'm thinking to myself, is this like a racist thing? Is this like a like, like, what even, like, I am even. it just doesn't make no sense to me, really. It really, it just really doesn't. But, what do you guys think? Do you guys think, yeah, like, pretty much, it's like, the general public said this. The man clearly just said this. Why specifically didn't the policeman do their job? Why didn't the policeman get his knees off the man's neck? At least the man could have at least catch his breath back and then survived the whole tragedy. But now... But if, so right now, yeah, I actually think that those three men should literally be punished, like just put to jail, and I mean put to jail for literally put to jail for life, because pretty much just like that, that is just really just unacceptable. They're just there to serve justice, but then you just see them here over here, yeah, thinking yeah it's just okay yeah to put some to put their knees on someone else's neck for the full eight minutes, and within that eight minutes, that within that eight minutes, two minutes. Two minutes and fifty six seconds have gone, and the man, is, uh, and the man has already died. Where's the, where's the sense in that? Where's literally the sense? That 
I'm not sure if it's like a racist thing or I'm not sure if it's like what like whatever it is, but that's just my opinion. What do you guys think? Do you guys think they should be put in like into jail for life or they should just get like a I don't know, just like a um like a fine or whatever. What do you guys think? And I'll put it down in the comments below and I would really love to read what you guys think. Um but that's all I have for you guys today. It was very, very frustrating me because literally, I just literally had to get it out there. I don't obviously know why people do this. Like, literally, we all live the same. We all, like, we all are born the same. We all live the same. We all breathe the same. We are all gonna, go, like, go out of this world the same. So, I don't really know why people, like, actually even do this. And for all of the, all, and for all of the policemen out there, literally, please, please, please be a little bit considerate in what you are doing. So, um... Yeah, so that's all I have for you guys today. Um, if you did like this video, please like, um, please subscribe, put it, um, put your opinions down the um, description below, and yeah, I will see you guys later. I'll see you guys next week, and I'll see you guys soon. So I'll see you guys later. Stay healthy and live longer.